this is McBurdy, and welcome back to another episode of Hyper Dimension Neptunia Rebirth 1. Um, I don't know what you guys think of this game, but this game is kind of fun. It's definitely not a type of game I normally play, but it's pretty fun. Um, I definitely had some troubles in the last episode, but that, that's a learning curve. Um, I'm hoping this episode I do a little better with fighting if we ever get into more fighting um, But we do have an event to see so we're gonna go right into it See what we have to do. Oh, it's information wander cat Oh, hello It's a plan to change the items you can get in a dungeon. Yeah, okay find out what you get with this Yeah Okay, that was a cute kitty monster cave. Oh, that's right, because you can change some things d in different areas if you want. I don't really see a need to do that, though. It's a nice <gasps> and warm day again, you. Oh, you're so cute! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry! She's just so cute! A nice cup of bitter hot tea would hit the spot, you. Oh, you're so cute! Hello. Um, can I ask you something? Okay. What, Mew? Is there something you want from Broccoli, Mew? Her name is Broccoli? What kind of weird oh, name? your name is Broccoli? <laughs> You're so cute that I want to call you Puchico. Puchico? It's Broccoli, <laughs> not Puchico, Mew. Oh my god. Let's not split pairs, okay? Oh, wow. You're terrible at listening, Mew. <laughs> anyway, I want to ask you, Puchico, how do I get to Planet Tower? Wow. I'm supposed to go there, but um, I don't know where it is. Why do you think she well, knows? Mew, just head down here and you'll see a sign for it, Mew. Sweet. Thank you. I've got to run now. Bye bye. Aww. Hmm. I feel like I'd met her before, Mew. Aww, you're so cute. Let me think a bit, Mew. Huh. Do you know her? Oh, that's right! That was Neptune! You know her the... You know her as Neptune? The ground! It split open! This must be where the ancient battle ensued. A battle where a goddess and an evil god seal each other with their weapons. Okay. What is she talking about? Yep, yep, says a lot of random things, but you'll get used to it. It's hard for me to keep up with these voices. <laughs> I'm not very good at mimicking them, but I'm trying. If you say so, but still, for losing her memory, Nep sure knows a lot. Uh, <laughs> Iffy, Kampa, the view from here is awesome. Oh, wait, are you scared? Yep, yep. This is a sky harbor. It's where we go to get to the other lands. The lands aren't connected, so we need to go through here. Uh, how do you get across? I know, jump, right? Like while saying, wahoo! <laughs> Why not grow a mustache and jump then? We need to go to the Basilicom. <laughs> I think that was a Mario reference. We fill papers there, and once we get approval, we can go across freely. Oh, okay, we need papers for that? Whoa, this is a crazy looking building. Hello! Welcome to Plan Neptune's Basilicom. What brings you here today? Could we get crossing approvals to go to the last station? All three of you to last station, correct? Yessy! Okay then, well, see you again, Mr. Nice Guy. Thank you, and you be careful now. <laughs> <clears throat> that Neptune girl was so small and cute. I hope she comes back again. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I've seen her before. Hmm. Everybody says that, it's weird. Chapter one, clear! Yay, achievement unlocked. Whoa, hey, boobs, Mickey. Arfwa. It has been a while, histoire. Arfwa, no matter how often you come, I have no intent to help you. I know. I came here to ask you about Neptune. Did you meet Neptune? 
So it was you after all. You're the one who's been guiding her. What can I do? I am sealed and unable to do anything. Hm. What a liar. No matter. I will defeat her another time. The goddesses are in my control. They shall fight by my will. Ha 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 ha. Gotta do a good evil laugh for that. Whoa! Whoa! This place does not look pretty. Wow! This place is all steampunky! Iffy, what's this place called again? Last Station. Ruled by CPU Blackheart. It's obscured by various industries. So, um, does the theme of each land match with that goddess's preference? No, the CPUs are here to protect us. It's us humans that shape the land. Aw, that's so realistic. Kampa, what are your thoughts of this land? <clears throat> These factories and chimneys remind me of an industrial revolution. But I'm not into this kind of thing. It's not for everyone, but I think it's nice. Now, let's go to the Basilicom. Uh, why do we need to go to the Basilicom again? Hey, Iffy, are we there yet? <laughs> Odd. I'm pretty sure it was in this direction. Don't tell me we're lost. I hope not, but it's been a while since I came. Let's ask someone. Okay. Well, how about that I'm going on an adventure looking person there? <laughs> hello, you with the red hair. Hmm? Oh, hello. What is it? I want to meet Lady Blackheart, but can you tell me where to go to meet her? Lady Blackheart? Oh, you mean Lady Noir? Well, just head down this path, take a right, and you'll find the Basilicom. Huh. Looks like the general direction was correct. <laughs> <laughs> Got to help each other in need, right? Yep. Well, since we've met, do you mind if I ask you your name? My name is Neptune. This here is Kampa and Iffy. My name is Falcom. I'm a newbie adventurer. Falcom. If you're in a pickle and you need help, just give me a holler. Aw, that's neat. Really? Thanks. Oh, we're in a hurry, so we have to run. Hope we meet again soon. Yeah, see you again. I made a friend. Hmm. What a surprise. I didn't expect to meet them in this realm. Huh? You know who they are? Um, excuse me. I came to meet Lady Blackheart, but is she around? This music is nuts. Who are you kids? This isn't a playground. Scram. Hey, that's no way to treat your guests. We really need to meet the CPU. We're trying to get Nep Nep's memory back. Oh, I know. This must be an event flag where I just have to name myself first. My name is Neptune. This here is Kampa and Iffy. Stop rambling. I don't care who or what you are. Now get out of here. Wow, so much for civility from the Basilicom. They say the clothes make the man, but I guess the CPU isn't all that great. Say what you want. I could care less what Blackheart is being called. Woo. Hey, you've got a group of cute girls here pleading. Come on, let us meet her. Nep, let's go. We're wasting our time here. Iffy, are you giving up already? It's a game over the moment you give up. Let's just go. Aww. Uh oh, whoa! This is the end! Whoa, she must be fighting. Hello? Yes? Well, that was easy. What a fool to have faced me! Whoa. Oh, how cute! Okay, that outfit's cute. Phew, I didn't expect so many monsters to be spawning in the land. Well, the area is cleansed, so I better head back to the Basilicom. Oh, that's a cute outfit. Now, I'm sure you're all wondering why I'm down in the last station. Whoa. After Neptune fell, we continued to fight, but we felt our powers weakening. Our power comes from people's faith or shares, which tends to sway. I hate to admit it, but I would have been next after Neptune fell. That's why I quit and came down here to get my shares up again. 
Now that I'm here, I've noticed that faith in me has been waning. It looks like a major company called Avenir has taken over last station. That's not good. With me gone, it looks like everyone put faith in Avenir instead. But that isn't the only problem I have with Avenir. They ousted my faithful from the Basilicom and took over the place. Now I'm being monitored, so I have to sneak out to maintain the peace here. Well, that's not good. Sigh. Basilicom. <sighs> I really don't want to go back there. I'm so mad! The Basilicom is one, but iffy, you're another. Why'd we leave? Didn't you notice? He didn't show any respect at all to their CPU. Oh, yes. He didn't treat the goddess name with respect. That's weird. What's so weird? Maybe they're like buddy-buddy and talk super casual. Well, there's no way people in the land would call their CPU by name. I propose we do some quests, but how about it? We still have money, right? Why do we need to do quests now? Oh, wait. Don't tell me you used up our funds for your own pleasures. No, we have money. It's not like I sneak out to buy pudding like you, Nip. What? You, 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 you knew? Dead obvious. You thought I didn't notice? Um, yep. Anyway, remember how the key fragment was with the disc in Planeptune? Don't you think it could be the same in Last Station 2? You're a genius, Iffy. I'm sorry to have thought you were useless earlier. <laughs> um, yep, yep. I don't think you needed to bring up that last part. Yeah, I don't think so either. Is that her? The person who wants us to fight monsters? She's kind of small. I was thinking like a big burly man or something. <laughs> she's staring at us. Now she's waving. I think she's the right person. Yeah. I suppose she's come to the same conclusion about us. Team up. So Team it's you up. girls? You're gonna take the work I ordered? Uh, wait, what? Are you sure you'll be okay? More than okay. Oh. Nice to meet you. I'm IF. This is Kampa, and that's Neptune. Well, I guess you wouldn't have come if you weren't okay. My name's Xion. I run a small factory called Passe. Now, no use standing around here. Follow me. Okay. Didn't you say you ran a factory? This place looks more like a cafeteria. Or, or a restaurant. My parents run the cafeteria. The factory is right next door. You'd rather speak at a cleaner place, right? Take a seat. <laughs> Dibs on the bar stool. There's plenty of bar stools to go around. With this cafeteria, you can order a heck load of parfaits and puddings. Wow. That's not going to create revenue, you know? <laughs> the factory isn't enough, so we make do with the cafeteria, too. Wow. Sorry to intrude, but could you tell us the details to the work? Sure. I need you to take care of the monster around the trade route. Hmm. It used to be safe, but recently a large monster appeared from nowhere. With the route unsafe, all trade is halted. Bingo. This may be the work we're looking for. We'll take that order. Sure. Good. Why not? With Avenir killing the market, we don't need any more problems. Xion. Xion. What's this Avenir? Wait. You don't know Avenir? Uh, we are not from yes. here. We just arrived into last station today, so we don't know this Avenir. Avenir is a major company that's pretty much ruling last station. They make everything from goods to weapons and is controlling the market. People like me can't compete with them, so our products don't sell well. Hmm. And it's not like they create work. I know a few who close shop already. Damn. That's terrible. It goes against antitrust laws. Didn't you talk with the CPU? It's hard to believe that she would let this go. Myself and others tried, but Lady Blackheart was away for too long. Avenir placed their goons in the Basilicom. Now they pretty much own it. Wow. Such a waste. Since Lady Blackheart just returned from Celestia, Avenir won't let us near the lady at all. 
so everyone Jeez, is that's bad. Terrible. Everyone is suffering because of them, right? They're not just bad. They're monsters. I see. So that explains the treatment we got back at the Basilica. So I guess we can't meet the goddess through the Basilicom then, can we? Nope. How about we barge into where the CPU Lady Blackhearth lives? <laughs> we could get Black info Hearth. on the key fragment and help Xion. What a bargain! Okay, nap nap. Let's go on south and stand by at Lady Blackhearth's room. Lady Blackhearth. Black <laughs> H-E-A-R-T. Not Lady Blackhearth. <laughs> but if you don't know where the lady is, the guards will just spot you. Wow. Well, we have to try, right? Yep. I'm more the type to try and fail instead of not trying at all. Wow. I'm back. Well, not like anyone would greet me. CPU, we've made mention many times to not go out alone without telling us. So, they won't even call me by name anymore. When and where I am is my choice. Are you trying to confine me? Sit here nice and pretty like a wallflower? N no that's not what we're getting at. We're just worried. Hmm. Well, I'll assume what you said is what you mean, then. And anything to tell me while I was gone? No, nothing in particular. Particular? So I assume something did happen, then. It is very petty, so it isn't of much interest to report on. By my orders, speak on this petty item. Three girls came by to see you and caused a commotion. That is all. Came to see me? Oh. <clears throat> so describe these girls to me. One of the girls was Neptune, Neptune, or something like that. <laughs> Did you say Neptune? A girl with light purple hair with a spiky lift? Yes, I suppose that is the Neptune. Ahem, Neptunes? No, Nepa, Nepi, oh my god. It does not make sense why they can't say her name. You can't say it right, can you? <clears throat> the Nep something girl does match the details. Do you know her? Know her? It's more than that. What is she thinking visiting me here in last station? Will you go and meet this girl? I believe that would be futile. What do you mean? It seems she lost her memory. That is why they came to see you. Lost her memory? Could it be because of that battle? If so, that explains a lot. CPU? If I fought Neptune with her memory back, would I be able to defeat her? But without her memory, I may be able to win. If I can beat Neptune, I can regain my seat of power back in Last Station. All right then. Time to make a visit to Neptune. All right, well, that was a lot of cutscenes and like information. Um, I didn't have time to actually go into any dungeons, but you know what? That is gonna be the next episode. If you guys are enjoying this series, please make sure to leave a like down below. And if you haven't already, please leave, leave a comment and subscribe to my channel. That way you can keep up to date with more episodes as I put them out. Thanks again, everyone, and I will catch you in the next episode. Bye!